Olivia Goldstein of Vancouver, who may look like a ballerina, but she's not. She's a world champion kickboxer. Than a boxer. But her high kicks have helped her win a world championship as a kickboxer. And her skill and wholesome good looks have also brought her nibbles from the movies. But don't mistake Leah's soft-spoken ways outside the ring. For when she's in it, she's lethal. Leah Goldstein's taste in music is a lot easier to explain than her love of kickboxing. I don't know, I've just always been involved in sports, very active person. Even today, you know, I can't just sit still or, you know, like, I can't head for a career where I'd be in an office and just sit at a, at a desk. I'd have to be very mobile and move around. She often trains to the music of her favorite group, the Parachute Club. Her vital statistics, she's 18 years old, five foot six, weighs 115 pounds, and she's the world's champion bantamweight woman kickboxer. Her coach, Al Ching, a former champion kickboxer from Hong Kong, has been working with her now since she was 13. Because you can't always do it? Sometimes go this way. Oh, just miss the Yeah, bag. because we're here. You are drawing my head up. The other one come. He says that he's always trained her like a boy. In fact, now he says she can take many of the boys he's trained. She trained really hard, and she's a smart. Every time I teach her the technique, she can pick up very quick. And later on, she can create her own technique. Unlike most fighters, Leah is not a child of the streets. She comes from an affluent family, but has earned her own place in her sport by an iron will and iron discipline. Every day or so, she's up before dawn for eight to 10 miles of road work with her coach. She graduated from high school last year, and she's off to college next fall. She intends to study law to please her father, physical fitness to please herself. At first, Leah didn't tell her family about the kickboxing. She knew that they would worry about it. Leah sometimes works in her father's manufacturing plant, running the heavy machines that they use to build or repair parts for ocean-going ships. Her dad's other employees will tell you that around work, Leah is a regular guy and asks no favors. <laughs> Leah's father, Sam Goldstein, had boxed in the Israeli army, and he once tried to discourage Leah by putting on the gloves with her. And when, when I give her a hook,